Hello guys, it is T Scottish Guy. Welcome back to the railway. If you're upset by trains of normal size and wish they could be miniaturized, gather round them can be found on the model railway. Model railway, model railway with tiny wire trees. Model railway, model railway, there is no disease on the model railway. And welcome back to another running session. And this will be probably the second running session I've done. And if you look on my model railway playlist, playlist on my channel, you will find my LNER running session that I did um, almost a year ago. And today I'm doing limited edition. That's locos I have that were limited edition. I have four locos that limited edition. And because I've got two tracks, I shall run two at once. So let's get going and I shall show you my limited editions. So the first two trains are going to be my Hornby Limited Edition Bitten and my Hornby Limited Edition Rocket. So this is the Rocket and I got this in June of 2020. It cost me £180, but my parents very kindly paid for 90 of that. It comes with three Liverpool and Manchester carriages, um, but I've only coupled up one since I can't buy my other couplings. This cost me around £180 from Kernel Model Railway Centre. It was well worth a buy. I did have to send it back to Hornby to get repaired, but now it's repaired and it's better than ever. So this is my Hornby Bitten. I got this in December of 2020 for Christmas from my parents. They, this is a one-on-one -on -one collection Bitten. Since Hornby, the old Hornby warehouse is now home to the one-on-one -on -one collection in which it's Bitten and it's in there whilst it's waiting for it to overhaul. So this runs really well and I've never had any problems with it. It also comes with its water tender and the water tender that's currently on Bitten was the one that was on Flying Scotland during its American tour. So here are the locos all ready to go. So I'm going to set Rocket off first on the outer line using my Gage Master Model D controller. There we go. I'll just set it to 50% power. Oh, it's stopped. There we go. And now I'm going to set Bitten off. I'm out of some power too, and it's pulling some teak coaches. So here it comes, Bitten with the teak coaches. And Rocket already on its way back, so set Bitten to 50% power. And we're going to set off now. So here, so here they come around the corner, here comes Bitten with his LNR teak coaches. Oh, power's cut out. There we go. Speeding along on the London North Eastern Railway, and here comes Rocket, chuffing along to Manchester or Liverpool. So there goes Rocket and here comes Bitten again. Zooming around the track. And the LNRT coaches are very beautiful. And now along comes Rocket. Oh, Bitten's, uh, Bitten's overtaken Rocket. And here comes Bitten again. And here goes Rocket. So we're going to have a speed test now, so I'm going to do one lap of full power. So I'm just going to stop this in there. And take Rocket up to full power. And send it off around the track. So that's Rocket at full power. Not too bad. Zipping along and then we can just stop it there. And Bitten, this is the fast one, full power. Very fast. So here they come now, just slowing them down now. So here comes Bitten. Oh, bit of a breaking stop there. And here comes Rocket. Slowly coming round. Just slow it down. Just stop. There we go. So there's the first two limited editions. So I'm going to send these off now and get the next two on. So I hope you like this part, guys. So because Rocket is very fragile, I'm not going to lift off the railway, I'm going to park it in this, in its shed here. Oh, we stopped. It's just the track that's the problem. I've got bad fish plates.
and we've stopped. So here are my last two engines. These are my Hornby Centenary Smoky Joe and my Bachman Limited Edition um, Class 37 Avro Vulcan XH558 which came with the beautiful models of the Avro Vulcan Bomber. So I'm going to show you them now. So this is my Bachman Diesel. I got this around May or March 2020. It was very kind of to me by my dad and my mum, so thank you mum and dad. And it was one of a thousand. I can't. I think mine was number nine eight one. So I was on the last ones. It runs really well. I think it's got a ring field motor, and the lights light up on the outside and inside. This is my Hornby Centenary Smoky Joe. This is, was again a number one of one out of a thousand. This was cost me about forty pounds. I I bought this for myself. It's very very well detailed and it's a very beautiful logo, worth forty pounds. Not a, not a fantastic runner, but it still runs okay. So here are the two logos ready to run. So I'm going to set the back one off first at fifty percent power. It's pulling some Pullman coaches. And now we're going to set Smoky Joe off at fifty percent power as well. And that's pulling some freight wagons. So here comes the back one, just heading around the corner. A nice little speech, you can see the lights are working. A lovely, lovely loco. And here comes Smoky Joe. Oh no, and Smoky Joe has lost its carriages. I'm guessing he's going to have to push him from the front now because we're heading for a collision. And we're fine. So Smoky Joe has stopped for some reason, I do not know why, and I shall go and investigate. But in the meantime, here is the back one coming round. Oh, and there's Smokey Joe. Smokey Joe's working again. Because Smokey Joe's not doing so well, I'm going to give Smokey Joe 80% power. Yep, yeah, that should do it. And here comes the Batman. And Smokey Joe's going behind it. Smokey Joe's going for the, going for the overtake. Who's coming around the corner first? It is Smokey Joe. And then followed by the backman. Let's take the let's raise the power to 80% like like Smokey Joe. Let's see what happens. So who's winning so far? And it is Smokey Joe. Well, I don't know how long that'll be because the backman is coming close behind. It's getting really close now here from Smokey Joe. Oh the backman's closing in on it. It's coming close. And the Bachman is just overtaking Smokey Joe. It's trying its best, it's just overtaking. This is a very, very good race. And I think the Bachman is just, the Bachman is just winning now. How are for the Bachman? So here we are, we're slowing them down now. So here comes the Bachman. Stop that there. And here comes Smokey Joe with their carriages. Slow that down. And there we are. So thank you for watching, guys. I do hope you enjoyed this little running session. Comment below what else you want to see in my haul me, because I'm going to do some more haul me videos soon. And thank you so much for watching, guys, and I shall see you in the next video. Goodbye.